Sam Speck with us here at the John Mandola Show, having tonight soccer. Um, so you're baseball player as well. Yeah. You love both sports. I do love both sports. And you're not sure at that next level, hey, I might want to play baseball in college. I might want to play soccer. Mm-hmm. Who knows? Right situation. But uh, let's talk about your passion for uh, for both sports. Yeah. So, I mean, I've always grown up. I mean, I've always been a big sports fan. I mean, I've, I've watched it my whole life, you know, and I've played it my whole life. Sports from basketball, you know, soccer and baseball. So I just enjoy all sports, really. I watch all sports, you know, so it's just... That's what pushes me to be a, a, good, a good athlete, you know. Let's talk about your work ethic and, you know, in the summer. Is it just soccer because soccer season's coming up, or is there some baseball involved too? I mean, I feel all year I'm just baseball and soccer. I mean, it's soccer for me, it's all year round, and baseball, you know, it's spring and summer, you know, so you always want to keep, you know, improving during those times, and you can't really take any time off, you know, it's you got to be diligent in what you do. Let's talk about that diligent part and, you know, skill set in soccer. What kind of player are you out there on the field? I mean, I feel I could. I mean, I, I could be a distributor. You know, I could distribute the ball when I want to. I mean, I could score when I want to. You know, I could do a lot out there. So I feel. I feel like it really makes me. You know, unique as a player. How about the coaching style? A uh, uh, coach, Frank, and you know what? What he brings to the table as far as a coach. And everybody said, hey, he tells us what to do. We just go do it. I mean, he's a, he's a great coach. I mean, he helps push us. I mean, he helps us. You know figure out what we're doing on the field, you know, if we're doing something wrong, I mean, we'll always hear it and, you know, we'll improve all that and then get better throughout the season, you know, and hopefully become the best we can by the end of the season, you know. Sounds, talking to other guys, that we're going to see a lot of zeros on the other end of the scoreboard. It's going to be tough to score on you guys. Talk about that defense and your keeper situation. Well, our keepers, you know, we have the best keepers, you know. They're just really talented. I mean, they're, they're vocal. I mean, they're just they're really good keepers. And our defense, you know, even though we lost some people, you know, it's, it's going to be really good this year as well. I mean, we just have people we can slot in and move up the depth chart, you know, and we'll be really solid back there. Let's talk about that depth chart because you, you need a little depth. You know, some guys might get tired. There could be some injuries like anything else. You feel like you have a solid four or five guys that can come off that bench and contribute? I, I think so. I mean, we have a lot of guys that can come off that bench. I mean, freshmen, sophomore, juniors, you know, even seniors can come off that bench. I mean. So it's, we really have a lot to give, you know, and a lot of players who could play some big roles for this team this year. How about as far as the family support, who's there for you, rooting you on, making sure you're making good decisions? I mean, my mom and my dad are always there for me. They're always there, you know, especially my dad. I mean, he, he played high school soccer when he was younger. So, I mean, he really tries and pushes me every day to really become the best athlete I can. All right, well, I hope you have a successful season and good luck. You've got great decisions to make in the future. Go get them. All right, thank you.